an engineer came to see Steve Jobs and said, I did my best, but I can't reduce the thickness of the product to the level you want. Angry Jobs threw the product into the aquarium. Then a few bubbles came out of the product that fell into the aquarium. When Jobs saw it, he yelled at the engineer. The air bubbles are proof that there's an empty space. The engineer was more concerned, and in the end came a thinner and better designed Apple product. Steve Jobs is known to have pursued and executed what he was certain to be right, even if he had to dissuade others from doing so, and for design, he did not make any concessions. It's hard to deny that Jobs' passion for the best is a key factor in Apple's success today. Google co-founder Sergey Brin praised his passion for the best. Steve, your passion for excellence is felt by anyone who has ever touched an Apple product including the MacBook I am writing this on right now. And I have witnessed it in person the few times we have met. I did my best, but this is what we often say when something fails or results fall short of the goal. Did my best is definitely a good word for spending all your heart and strength on something. But unfortunately, many people are using the term as a means to justify their failures and poor results. Do you want to be the best? If so, don't use the word did my best. The word best is something you really have to say when you've done everything you can, but what's important is not to do your best but to achieve your goals.